Yo, what's up there guys? This is Immersive Game 83 and thank you very much for stopping by. Really excited, we've got an update from Ralph regarding Vorpex updates. 0 0.9 announcement. And it looks really cool, so let's have a little look, see what's going on there. So we'll read more. Uh, we'll take us into the next bit. Okay, so it's going to be later this month. So sometime in September we'll be getting this out. We've got a largely reworked DX11 geometry render, which is cool. So we've got a few extra games and better compatibility. Uh, the biggest one for me as well is the fact that they're going to be supporting the newest 0 0.7 uh, driver, which means that no more extended mode. So that could be a really, really good thing for performance and, you know, actually the, the games themselves. And I'm sure Ralph is aware that a lot of us need the mirror functionality. So I'm still hoping that he's going to make it possible for us to record by adding the mirror functionality. If he does that, everyone's going to be happy with it. Everyone's going to be moving over to 0 0.7 pretty much. But yeah, in that, that that's the main concern for me is still being able to get the content out to you guys. Um, but yeah, that's really, really good. So we've got a load of a load of other stuff going on as well. So super smooth cinema mode, internal resolution scaling, lots of down sampling, which is nice. Um, dodgy resolution, so you don't you're not locked into uh, 1920 by 1080, which is cool. Uh, better gamepad handling because the gamepad emulation with Vorpex was a bit shitty, to be honest. Uh, it didn't really work very well. It was sort of very, very limited to what you could do. So it's very nice um, that also you can add certain things. So with Vireo, if you just sort of turn the, the, the right stick left and right and, and up and down, you can lock it off. So only the left and right functionalities work. So you still get to use the functionality of up and down just using your head and I really like that from Vireo so I'm glad to see that Vorpex have actually adopted this as well and it's going to be really cool um, so overall very happy when they say the largely reworked DX11 geometry so better compatibility with games I mean they said uh, expect a few more DX11 titles I'm hoping that Grand Theft Auto is going to be one of them and can you imagine GTA 5 with geometry it's going to be so fucking sick can't wait for that. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping, I'm hoping that's in there. Um, as soon as I hear anything else, guys, you'll be the first to find out. That's Immersive Game 83, and I hope to catch you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.